Hi, this is Thomas Shepard, and this screencast is a part of the MCAS project at Athabasca University. In this tutorial, we're going to continue on from the last one, where we imported a song called Rocket, it's actually just music, uh, that we're going to use for our project. So what we want to do first is we want to have that music in, as part of the intro. What we're going to do is we're going to move that first up to the top of our list so we can edit it next to our intro and we can do that very easily in the drop down menu you click that and if you remember that's where we went to the name uh, our tracks and here is the option to move the track up so we're going to do that a few times and move the track up a bit and when we do I want it up at the very beginning so I want the music to play before you hear any of the voice that uh, from the intro track so here's what we're going to do we're going to move uh, first our intro. I'm going to mute the other two tracks for now uh, and adjust them after. But I want to uh, use Rocket to play uh, with my intro. Now right now if I played it, and I'm going to make sure I got the beginning by hitting the rewind. I'm going to hit the play button. Hi, this is Thomas Shepard and this podcast is a part of the MCAS project at Athabasca University. Now, now this doesn't sound too bad, but it's a little bit loud. And I want it to fade out when I, by the time I'm finished uh, talking. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to use the time shift tool. We're going to move our intro and we're going to put it in probably anywhere from 10 to 15 seconds in. And uh, what we'll do is we'll put it right there for now. And uh, I'm going to just going to play this right quick and see where the music puts picks up to. Uh, I think it's playing a little bit long before I speak, so I want to move that back a little bit. Okay, and uh, what I want to do, by the time I finish, I want it faded out completely. So here's what we're going to do. First, we are going to select the portion that we want to use. So I want it to finish by the time I finish my intro. So I'm just going to click in here. I'm going to highlight the rest of this rocket track, and I'm going to hit delete to get rid of it. Now. What I'm going to do is, that's not too bad now, uh, where I've got the uh, intro ending, or the music ending when my intro ends. I like that uh, there. And it doesn't, uh, it plays a bit of music before I do. But I want it to fade out. I don't want it to be too loud when I start talking. So now we need to add a little bit of an effect. So I'm going to just highlight that whole track. And I'm going to go to effect, and I'm going to go to fade out. You'll notice it narrows down your uh, soundtrack and so that to nothing by the time you finish your intro so uh, let's let's just have a look listen to that now hi this is Thomas Shepard and this podcast is a part of the MCAS project at Athabasca University Excellent. So that sounds pretty good. Now, uh, what we can do is there's several options here. We can have that music kick in again and have it fade in and play in as we are talking. But uh, um, it's a matter of personal preference. I prefer not to have any audio uh, or any music playing when I'm uh, doing a, a podcast or when I'm talking. So uh, what we'll do is we'll leave it there for now. We're going to save this. I'm going to file Save Project. And it, once you have your project saved, it'll save it automatically anyway. It doesn't ask you to give it a name because it already has one. And we're going to leave it right there for now and end this tutorial. And in the next one, we're going to put uh, music at our outro and have it fade in and or, or our closing. And uh, we'll see how, how this thing comes together. And we're going to line our tracks. Thank you very much for listening. As always, if you have any feedback, you can email me, tomshep at gmail.com that's t-o-m-s-h-e-p-p at gmail.com appreciate any feedback and thank you for watching our tutorial